Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Beauty Venom. Um, today I'm going to do a haul of some stuff that I got in the mail today. I got my birch box in the mail. Really excited to see what's in here. have no idea what's in here, so I'm going to open it with you. And I got um, a box of stuff that I ordered from Inglot. So I'll open that too. Um, I'm going to use my knife to open it up. If you guys don't know what Birchbox is, it's a company, um, you pay $10 a month and they send you a box every month and you get like deluxe samples so you can try a bunch of new things and it's always like a surprise because you don't know what's coming. It's like that. There's another box inside. What's this? Exfoliating, exfoliate foaming cleanser by Suki Face. Never heard of this brand. Excited to try it. It's lemongrass extract and natural sugar. So it's a nice little size. Um, I could probably use it like three times, three, four times. So just enough to let me know if I like it or not. So I got that in here. And this is how it looks. It comes in here with the pink tissue paper. And everything's just in there like that. Let's see what's in here. Ooh. Nail polish. This one is by Color Club. And it's in the color Rain in Spain. Pretty color, perfect for summer. It's reading more pink on the camera. But it's actually like a... Uh, Almost like a neon coralish color. And a Juicy Couture Lala sample. I love perfume. I always want to buy perfume, so this is perfect for me. Try that out. Actually, let's try it right now. Oh, I think I like it. It's it's kind of floral, but it's not it's not overpowering. So I, I think I might like this, but I'll have to wear it a lot longer for me to tell if I like it or not. And I've got a Miraness Glossy Kiss in Starlet. Oh my God! Wow, look at that sample size. That's like not even a sample size. It looks like a full size. Impeccably glossy natural lip and cheek stain with high impact color that helps you create the catwalk lips and cheeks everyone will envy. And this one is in number two, Flirty Kiss. Another brand that I have never heard of, but I'm like really excited to try this. Wow. I can't believe they put that in here. That's awesome. I'm loving this box this month. <gasps> Matchbox Itty Bitty Files by Tweezerman. Nail files. How cute are these? And they've got paws on them. Wow. And Destination Inspiration. Away we go. Looks like postcards. Bunch of cute postcards. I haven't written a postcard in forever, but I might now just because I have these. Send one to my sister and one to my mom. So that's it for this box. Love it. Can't wait to try all this stuff. Now for the Inglot box. I ordered this stuff, so I, I, I chose the stuff that's in here, but I don't really actually remember all of the stuff that all of the colors that I chose. So let me find out. Oh my god. Look at that. Inglot goodness. So I got an empty palette from the Inglot Freedom System so that I could fill it up with eyeshadows. I have one other Inglot palette already, so this will be my second. Looks like that. Empty. The top is magnetic off like that. 
snaps back on. So let's look at the colors that I chose. So the first one is number 434. And I don't like the fact that they have numbers because it's hard to remember. It's, it's not memorable when it has numbers. I mean, I know which ones that I like, but if I had to like point it out to someone, I wouldn't remember the number. It's a pearl dark plumish color. I'll go ahead and snap that in there like that. Just goes in like that, doesn't fall out. Second color is 605, also a pearl. It's a very like rust color. I love that. I can't wait to play with that one. Next color is a matte color. It's number 387. It's a light gray. I'm going to break it before I even try it. It's a light gray color. This one is also matte. It's number 361. And this is kind of like a, um, a pinkish color. Pretty. And these are all random colors. I just chose them because I liked them. I didn't try to like make some sort of unique type of palette like I'm going to do all a color family or something. I just chose what I liked. So maybe as I get more, I'll switch the palettes around so that they're kind of more uniform. This one is number 44. It has a shine finish. It's like a dark green with a sparkle to it. Number 359, another matte pink. Number 366, this is a matte dark coral reddish color. Number 41, this is a, a yellow and it has a shine finish to it. I can see it better without my hand. Sparkle. This is number 338 and this is a matte color. It's like a um, kind of like a dark aqua dark teal color. This one's really pretty. This is number 441, and this is a pearl finish, and it's a really pretty um, purple. It's like a true purple. It's really nice. And that is it for my new Inglot palette. Like I said, I put them in here in no particular order, but I may um, interchange them with the other palette and kind of make it a little bit more uniform. But um, I like it. I'm really, really excited to play with all these colors, so... Let me know if you guys have any um, Inglot palettes and you have any colors that are your favorite because this is only my second palette so I'll probably be looking to get some new ones and I always have a hard time picking which ones I want because I feel that the swatches really aren't true to color on the website so it's kind of hard to choose so um, let me know what your favorites are and I'll um, try those next and um, that's it. Thanks for sharing with me and I'll see you guys next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.